Okay, looks like I'm gonna go... Yeah, we are moving into the next game. I'm not quite sure what round it is, considering I've been answering private messages and my administrator, uh, second administrator asking for the password of my account to be able to access the tournament's brackets and help these players to take questions for... Well, he'll be administrating the tournaments for me and I will be casting. But yes, moving into this, it is on Cloud Kingdom, so it is the third round. These players will be, uh, actually I think it may be, let's have a look. Quarterfinals is uh, best out of three. And it is in fact on, da -da 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 -da. I will be pausing that. Yep, quarterfinals, Shakuras, Antigua, Shipyard, round three, there we are. It's all mixed up, yes. Zeke is just weird, I must say. Uh, but yes, I'm going to go ahead and introduce the players. I've already got the production and the players up there. And spawning in the bottom left-hand corner as the yellow Protoss, we have CT Moston. Do not know what CT stand for, stands for, but it may be a community, a clan. I do not know. These players have not notified me as of this uh, yet, so I can't pull a little bit of an introduction of their community. Uh, but here is a PvP, ladies and gentlemen. Spawning in the top right-hand corner as the green Protoss, we have BBQ Barbecue. Anything stands for BBQ. Oh my god, barbecue sounds nice right now. <laughs> You're making me hungry by saying your username. Uh, but yes, it is a PvP matchup. I have not actually casted one PvP matchup in the European tournaments. I know this is the seventh European tournament, and it is very surprising, but I have not casted a PvP matchup as of yet. Very, very incredible. What to expect in this kind of matchup, I am not quite sure. Could be either a very, very cheesy 4-gate, um... Could be absolutely incredibly anything, but looks like a very, very nice little uh, denial. Barbecue was trying to deny that gas, and it looks like Mostyn is going to go get that second gas, so very, very nice from his end, and Barbecue will not be able to deny that gas. These gas openings looks like it may be going into a three gates robot, maybe a heavy kind of four gates, I do not know. You could even expand, maybe doing a two, uh, one gate expansion. I've seen this work in PvP, very, very standard build as I have personally experienced and seen in PvP matchups uh, through practices. In fact, PvP matchups, you can actually take them into PvT matchups, considering, yep, very, very nice actually. I like this, I've seen this build. Uh, one gate uh, double chrono boost, saving that double chrono boost for a uh, stalker popping out. Not just one stalker, but it could be a second stalker, op stalker opening to be able to scout these uh, pylons positionings. Like, uh, if you get a double stalker popping out to be able to deny uh, the scout of the probe in the natural, just just basically scouting all around for that pylon uh, popping down. But it looks like um, Barbecue will not be getting that map control, so yep, he will be doing that right now. No, he, in fact, he won't. He'll be moving back, maybe wanting to get a little bit more saturation with that one probe. But in the meantime, we do see him not chrono boosting in his cybernetics core, so it does not look like it will be a four gate. It is, in fact, a two gate robo as of now. And for the meantime, we do see Mostyn already going for that double, uh, yeah, three gates? No. Oh my good god. So it is a one gate, star gate, maybe into a three gate, uh, Robo. Absolutely love this build. This is a diamond to master's level build if you can actually... The reason why I say it, it is a diamond to master's build is how you basically do it. Like, how you personally do the build. I can't think of the word. What is the word? Uh, how you perform the build? Perform the build, I guess. I guess that's a nice way of you guys to understand it. I do not know why. I can't think of the other word. But yes, in the meantime, we do see a barbecue going for that very, very fast Raybo. Uh, yeah, it was a one gate Raybo into a three gates, uh, eventually into a very fast one base Colossus. So... Mostyn, in fact, has, is going for the counter for this straight away. Going for Stargate, Phoenixes will be able to snipe that one Colossus off, and it is... Both players haven't even expanded, guys, so... This will be a very... If these players do not expand from the 7-minute mark, we will be seeing somewhat of a all-in uh, from Barbecue, or a de very, very, very good defense from Mostyn. But in the meantime, we do see him going for that, yeah, it is a one gate into a 
uh, star gate into that uh, second gate and eventually into a Bravo. Very, very solid build. Depending how he performs it, I've got to say he is doing this very, very well. In the meantime, I, there is three different types of a one gate into a star gate build. And I think he's doing the second one. Yeah, he's doing the second one. And considering he's already seen that he's scouted his opponent, he knows he's going Colossus. I'm pretty sure he has scouted that Colossus Bay. Yes, he has. He knows about the Colossus and it all in coming in as of yet. This, uh, these Phoenixes will be able to get the scout on that uh, one pylon. I'm pretty sure he actually did scout it. Yes, he has scouted it and these, uh, his army will be moving out and to be able to deny that. Absolutely no problem. And it looks like he actually did, in fact, cancel it. And these Phoenixes will be able to get the scout and... Few probe kills, absolutely. I'll take, it, take that with for free. Thank you very much. And that was, Colossus was very, very close to dying. And any free stalkers, four, five stalkers to be able to defend this. I can't say he will be uh, winning this. I can't say that. Keeping up with the immortal, already got five phoenixes on the field. One Colossus in comparison. No, two Colossus moving out right now. One base all in and now, ladies and gentlemen. He might as well pull all of his probes. I got to say, <laughs> not even expanding behind this. Uh, moving out right now, not defending it, so these phoenixes will be able to get the, a few snipes. Yep, three stalkers to be able to defend that. It looks like forcibly pulling those phoenixes back. Very, very unfortunate. He should have actually just let them kill him while he, mo in fact, moved out. When the army over here is, in fact, absolutely nothing. So when these phoenixes move in right now, they will be able to try and get the snipe on those two colossus. But, yeah, very unfortunate from a... Moston, he will not be able to do that considering there is five stalkers right there. So, in fact, he's going to go ahead and make more stalkers. And I gotta say, Moston is in a very, very good position in right now. Unless he actually miss micros his phoenixes and he does not snipe the, away those colossus, I can't say he will be getting there. <laughs> winning this engagement, you know? No sh force fields going down as of yet. Keeping up with the phoenix production, very, very nice from Moston. Behind this, it uh, looks like. Barbecue is not expanding, but Moston has already got a pylon ready and apping to go to be able to counter this. No continuous production in the Colossus is coming down for him, just keeping up with the war pins. Looks like Barbecue is going to go ahead and pull back I and expand. Okay, so knowing he can't win that engagement, he sees that these Phoenixes are getting that map control. I gotta say, that's probably the smartest decision from Barbecue, considering how that uh, engagement could have gone. It will be skill based, depending how that engagement actually went. So, very, very not smart from Barbecue to go ahead and pull back and expand. Getting that contain and pulling back. But it looks like Moston, he can, in fact, move out right now and probably take this, you know? Seeing what damage he can do, losing, not losing any Phoenixes, already moving into the m n main base, maybe getting a few proper kills. It looks like he is, in fact, doing that right now. Getting two pro kills, running away, not even losing one Phoenix. Very, very nice Phoenix micro on his end. But it looks like he will be losing one Phoenix. Oh, Nothing really much he could have done about that. But it looks like Barbecue, he's not even going to go for that Twilight Council. Just keeping up with the pro production. Um, yeah, just keeping up with the pro production and Moston. He's already going to go ahead and go for the double... Yeah, Twilight Council and a Forge. Keeping up with the pro production. Well, not pro production as of yet. It just stopped. And he's, in fact, got a later expansion while he in, in, is moving out right now. Again, keeping up with the Phoenix map control is massive. I've got to say it's very, very in favor of Moston right now. Barbecue is very unfortunately supply blocked. But he is in the supply lead in the meantime. Barbecue, in fact, is not going for a Twilight Council yet. Yes, no, he's still going for Forge. He's not wanting to get Blink. Blink would be the hard counter against this, my friend. Very unfortunate to see that, not hit see him do that, but he is out positioning his opponents, so that's very good. Maybe he feels he doesn't need it. Maybe he's uh, a baller, as m most my American friends might say. <laughs> baller. Oh, good God. Okay, but yes, keep it up with the Phoenix production. He knows that he's continuously going to go ahead and make Colossus, and more Stalkers will be able to counter those Phoenixes. But behind this, Moston. Uh, a little bit, of d okay, missed timing with that probe spl uh, split, so that's weird from him. <laughs> Not getting Colossus, keeping up with the Immortal production, very, very nice to see from him, but I'd love to see for him to go ahead and get his third right now, considering he knows where the army positioning is right now. Getting two free, free Stalker kills, absolutely no problem from his end. Very nice. Gotta say that's a good trade. 
Um, yes, yeah, so as I was saying, I was, I'd love to, for him to see him actually go for that third and go for that Colossus tech and double Colossus production as of now. But in fact, he's not doing that. He's going to go ahead and go for Chargelet Archon. Very, very... I've got to say, that's another hard counter to Colossus, so that's... that's yeah, I, I, can't, I can't say it's bad. But considering he's got the Phoenixes and going straight for Archons, yeah, I can say, see this working. But already we do see uh, Barbecue moving out. Try oh, catching those Phoenixes out of positioning, not sniping one of them. Very, very quick reaction from Austin. Very nice to see on his end. But Barbecue is moving out right now. M Austin must be feeling very out of position right now. Oh, trying to snipe these three Colossus. Very, very nice to see from him. Will he snipe it? No, he will not get the shield down on them, though. So very, very nice to see from there. Not uh, Trying not to get his army out of position, so he's going to take down these rocks and move his whole army together. Very, very smart from Barbecue, I must say. Um, these Phoenixes. So many Phoenixes. What's that? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 Phoenixes. Splitting his army up. Very, very nice to see. Not splitting his Immortals as best he can. One Archon, in fact, though. But, i got to say, Mostin has more, more army. Barbecue, in fact, does have more Colossus, but he has split up his army. He is ready to, to engage that, and these Phoenixes are ready to move in as they st um, his army moves in. So, these Phoenixes will be able to get the scouts the best way they can, and maybe get in a free Stalker Snipe. I do not know. No, they will not. In fact, I do not know. Nope. No Phoenix. No uh, air upgrades as of yet. But both players are going for that. those upgrades as fast as th they can. Already level 1 has completed for Mostin, and pl plus 2 is on the way. But in comparison to Barbecue, he has got no upgrades, so I can't say he will win this engagement in, uh, against Mostin. Mostin is very, very, like, in favour right now, I've got to say. Looks like uh, this... Oh, very, very nice. Oh, good God! <laughs> what's, what's going on right now? He, he actually engaged! Okay, good God! Looks like Mostin uh, will win this engagement. And Barbecue actually, in fact, tried to get the Warp Prism... Uh, well, he did, in fact, get the Warp Prism drop right there. But uh, behind that, those Phoenixes actually did get the snipe on that Warp Prism. And warping in a few zealots to be able to deny that, considering they have plus one in comparison to plus zero upgrades for <laughs> barbecue. And engaging while he dropped, I gotta say that wasn't the smartest decision, considering with those phoenixes on the field right next to that warp prism. And barbecue going ahead, say the well played, and yeah, I gotta say that is the good game.